Discretion is advised. Okay, guys, so we're out here right now, and we got the uh, property owner of the golf course who's interested in getting all these uh, iguanas out of here uh, as much as we can. So me and my good friend Mike are actually trying to see if we can help out the property owner with this issue. And uh, we have golf, golf, golf players playing right now, so I'm trying to be as quiet as possible so I don't interrupt their game. Uh, so we have two Liguanas straight over here, about 40 yards away from us. And they're on a tree right now, and we're trying to make sure that we can get them without, you know, uh, making a bad call as far as who's around us. So we have to be very careful. Where's our backstops? We have to think about the backstops. We have to think about where the shop placement's gonna be. And uh, uh, hopefully, you know, me and Mike are pretty much veteran shooters. So as far as the accuracy of the, of the guns that we have today, uh, we're not really too concerned about that, but we still gotta worry about elements as far as wind and uh, just make a, a wise decision as far as, you know, what we're gonna do as far as taking the shot place, the shots on these animals. Uh, so right now we got Mike. Mike's gonna come up and he's gonna see if he can take out a couple of iguanas and uh, we'll be back. Yeah, I see him. He's sitting right there. Got him. Man, I'm having such a blast, man. So, guys, just a uh, refreshing. This is day two out here. And we just got out here about 10 o'clock. We're, we're trying to get, you know, come at a time where these guys are just coming out. And 10 o'clock seems like the magic number on a cold day. Not hot. Okay, nine cold day. already. Nine. nine. 40 minutes. In 40 minutes, we already hit nine. And, and you know, like I said, guys, I'm really sorry. You know, I can't get every single shot on camera. It's really hard, first of all. Mike already has experienced this already from my end, how hard, how difficult it is for me to film, get a shot, get a camera rolling, set it all up. Uh, so I can't get all the shots for you, but I'm getting a, a good, I will say about 50% are gonna be on camera and a 50% is gonna be off camera. And it's not purposely done, but that's just the way it's working out. You know, I'm trying to have fun out here as well <laughs> as, as hunting, you know, besides trying to entertain you guys. Oh, there he goes, he just okay. dropped. And he then we got dropped. three in a cluster you shoot one, the other two just sit there. You shoot the second one, the other one just sits there. And then you take the third follow-up yeah. shot to go after all three, where you would like to stop and film each individual, but... Yeah, it's, it's, it's gonna be impossible, it's, it's guys, to, to film everything, but trust me, I'm trying my best to do it. But, uh, you know, we're here really to have some fun, but I just want you guys to come along with us. Uh, like I said, this is Mike's permission, and Mike invited me to come down here. Awesome guy. And I'm having a blast. I'm having the time of my life right now. I am having a blast, but it's definitely more fun having somebody with you that you know trust, that shoot safe, that we can keep this place safe and we're not taking any unsafe shots. Yep. Yes, there's a lot of uh, iguanas that we could be shooting, but there's no safe backstop, so we're letting those yep. go or yep. until they move to a better location. That's right. And we have also have to take, we're alternating between sharing shots because we'll have to look out for other people while I'm taking a shot, I'll look out for him while he's taking a shot. And then sometimes we have a real good backstop, we can both shoot. Right now, we're both lucky that we can both kind of shoot. A little slow in traffic. Friday on a golf course, you know, during the weekend, this won't be hot. But during the week, we got a little bit of hope. So we're going to keep these guys posted. And uh, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Got him. Headshot. Got him. Yep. 
Got him. Headshot. Headshot. Got him. Headshot. Got him. Headshot. Oh, I see a monster. Oh, this is a big boy. Oh, that's a monster. Oh, that's a monster. Got him. Headshot. Headshot. <laughs> Got him. Headshot. Headshot. 60 yards, baby. Fifty-six yards. Fifty-six yards. So fifty-six. I'll do it at fifty-five. Fifty-five yards will be fine. Okay. Let's get this right. One shot, one kill, baby. Let's do this. One shot, one kill. Um, headshot. Nice. Got him. I was one in the bucket. Here we go.
got him. Headshot. Headshot. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. Nerves are going. Nerves are going. He's done. 50 yards. Fifty yards, baby. No, I'm still looking at mine. I want him to drop. I got him on camera, that's why. He's dead. Just hanged. Just hanging. I'm gonna go for one more heart and lung shot just to make sure. He's dead, but I just wanna make sure. Oh, never mind. Got him. Hit shot. That left one is still moving. He moved twice already. <clears throat> I mean, he's probably going to croak soon. He doesn't. Yeah, he's right behind the tree. I'm going to give him one more in the head. He's done. Guys, amazing, amazing, amazing two days here at this beautiful golf course. Uh, like I said, I'm gonna say it again. Mike, thank you so much, buddy, for getting this permission for us. This was a blast. Uh, I know a lot of these guys down here are going to these canals and they're shooting in front of the public, you know, which they, they're not getting in trouble for, for doing that. But, you know, you're taking more of a chance and a risk of, you know, having law enforcement getting involved and making your day just not as fun and pleasant. We're here. We're on private property. Uh, the golfers here were amazing, guys. Very amazing. Friendly. Very friendly. Very friendly. Oh, encouraging us. Yeah, take them out. You know, get rid of all of them, please. Kill them. And, 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 and it's amazing. I, I, I love the people here. The staff here was great to us. Uh, the facility was awesome. We didn't have to worry about no law enforcement, private property. Uh, it, it, it was great. It was great. The scenery is beautiful. The weather is awesome. Awesome day. Right? Yeah. Awesome day. A little breezy this morning, but it kind of definitely died down today. Uh, so I, I can't even complain as far as the weather, the, the, the time frame that we came, and just the overall, the whole experience was phenomenal. I had a great time. So me and Mike are wrapping up day two, guys. Day two. Guys, yesterday on day one, we did 54. 54. 54 on day one. Mike, please, my brother, tell them how many we got today. <laughs> we topped it. 64. We started about an hour earlier. There was a lot of wind in the morning. 
So they weren't kind of out at the beginning because of the wind and the cold. Then about an hour later they came out, roughly about the same amount of time yesterday. 64. 64 guys. Today. God. I mean, we crushed it. It was like 130 in two days. Yep. I'll take it. It's been a lot of fun. A blast. God. Definitely had fun with you, Will. I appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, buddy. Well. Me too. Likewise, Definitely man. Had a good we time. had a real good time. Guys, look at this beautiful monster that I got today. I got one of these yesterday too. But look at this thing. I'm going to bring it closer for you guys to see it. Look at this guy. He's a monster. Look at this thing. Oh, mm, oh I, I, don't, I'm, I don't need them, but you know, it's beautiful. They're beautiful creatures, guys. I don't disrespect them at all. Uh, me and Mike came out here with a mission to do an honorable favor to the uh, property owner and uh, make sure that the property owner had some kind of you know, uh, satisfaction out of, of out of us coming here, especially her meeting Mike for the first time. Uh, very skeptical, you know, so I understand. Anybody I meet, I'm gonna be very skeptical too. On day one, extremely happy. She says, you got 50? I can't believe you got 50. 50. We had nobody ever hit even 50. nowhere near that number. 54 total. I'm yeah. scared to tell her that we got 64 today because she might catch a stroke. <laughs> So, yeah, guys, a lot of them fell into this water. If you can see right behind us, they all lay on the trees. Some are on the ground. These are the ones that we got on the ground. And this is not all of them. This is uh, 16, 17 of them. No, 18. I got two more over two there, there, the vultures. Six more over there we got to go get. We got six more over there in different areas. Or, you know, golf course, all different holes. We got them scattered out through this whole golf course. And they're everywhere in the golf course. So this is just one little area. Crazy guys. Well, Mike? If I could just throw one thing in, the only thing I could say not being a YouTuber is I always had a lot of questions in reference to what kind of gun, we all know that. How many feet per second and what pellets are we shooting? I think a lot of people might be interested in that. Yes, okay, yeah, very so good. I'm so shooting the 25 caliber, both of these are 25 caliber. I'm shooting 25 caliber Hades. And I tell you, the Hades have been awesome, unbelievable. Almost no complete penetration, staying in the body, and my uh, feet per second is 939 feet per second, round figures 940. This gun is kicking it, and these things are taking a lead headache. Yes, I'll call it. lead <laughs> headache ain't the word. Yep. Now, now, don't get me wrong, guys. These guys ain't easy to kill. These guys here are built like tanks. There are some that will take probably about 20 shots if you let them. You have to hit them right in the head, right at the right spot every time. Body shots, we we took some because of the Hades. We know how they expand and break up into fragments. Uh, or the body was with a, a safe backstop. The head was not a safe backstop. So we took a body shot because we knew that if it penetrated, we were gonna have a tree as a background, a small tree. So that's why we attempted those, but normally, try to do the headshots. Right, so like I said guys, it was tons of fun. Uh, I, I'm, I'm trying to be as quick as possible because I, the time frame in this video is gonna be extremely long guys, and I'm sorry, I can't do nothing about that. Break it into two, and then how many feet per second and what pellet are you shooting? Uh, for this guy here, you guys already know that I'm using the 33.95 uh, grain uh, JSB King Heavy Mach 2. And you uh, know already that I believe I uh, did a test with this and it's, they're running at about 950 to 955 on a hot day and, and on a cold day about 940 to 935. So that's uh, pretty much my velocity between cold and hot. But uh, yeah, same setup. Uh, there's so much filming today, guys. I ran out of side shot footage. The only other thing I will say, I don't know if it's gonna show up on the video or the, or the audio, is sometimes when we hit these things, it sounds like somebody smacked them with a baseball bat. Yeah. Like dead solid, oh, like yeah. somebody cracked a home run. Oh yeah. It's how loud the impact is. Yeah, <laughs> yes they are. I mean, them Hades there, uh, guys, if you're looking for some good destructive pellet, yeah, them Hades will do the job in 25 caliber. Awesome, awesome. Very accurate. I'm getting nickel size 
poles at 50 and up to 75 yards, then they start to go out a little bit after little 75 bit, yeah. yards. But that's any yard. pellet. That's any pellet you shoot is going to, the, the accuracy is not going to be as perfect at 75, 80 yards. And what would you say our average distance is? Sometimes a lot of people uh, have a tendency yeah, to ask we, that Yeah, we were, I think our longest, our, our furthest shot was 100 yards. 100 yards. Uh, and our that average. Our man Will. Yeah, well. Hey, don't, don't sleep on this guy. This guy right here is a good marksman, too. Um, uh, and the average was about 50 to 45 yards or 40 yards. 50 to 40, 40 yards was our average. And then we'll go up to like 65 or 60, depending on where we could shoot. That's the only thing. We had to be real safe here on this property. So we had to really look out for each other as we were shooting. Uh, he'll shoot. I'll shoot. And when we were both able to shoot, we are both able to shoot. And... We got it done, great, no one got hurt. It was totally safe, everybody loved us. And we're definitely, we're definitely, me and Mike are definitely coming back. Coming back. back. <laughs> but uh, anyway sure. guys, thank you for watching. As always, God bless America, and I'll see you guys on the next round. I agree with that.